to have a conversation with somebody rather than try to shut them up. We have to remember back in 2019, Kamala Harris wanted to kick Donald Trump off of all social media. We believe in debating and having a conversation with our fellow Americans, agree or disagree. That's how you lift this country up, not by shutting people down, making life unaffordable for their families. You were talking about Donald Trump's social media. Would you describe his posts over the last 48 hours as, as, as lifting people up, quoting, reposting QAnon statements, reposting these misogynistic memes about Vice President Harris and Hillary Clinton? That's the kind of open discussion that you think is lifting people up? Oh, John, I think if you look at Donald Trump's full campaign appearances and, yes, his social media appearances, what you see is two things, a guy with an agenda to lower prices and bring back American prosperity and a political candidate who isn't stodgy, who likes to have some fun and likes to tell some jokes. I'd much rather have mm -hmm. a candidate who's willing to go off script, who's willing to give every interview and is willing to tell some jokes. I do think that's how you lift people up. A politics of boring scolds telling people they can't laugh, that is not lifting Americans up. That's how to tear us down. All right, fun and jokes. Uh, last night after CNN released a small clip of the Harris interview, you on Twitter posted a clip from a Miss Teen USA beauty